Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So I am going to explain how to draw a list of dictionary section in AutoCAD. Uh, here change and elevation so which are uh, I already typed here. But these measurements are from the survey. Uh, I got these measurements. Now I am going to draw this uh, in AutoCAD. Uh, have, we can't directly plot it there, so we have to some sort of things we have to do and formulate these things. And we have to formulate those things and paste it on AutoCAD. That's the main idea. But In AutoCAD, type units, then check its precision uh, 3 and go to meters. So, meter settings, then OK. Right? This is our sheet setting. Then go to annotation, click on textile, and put uh, 0 0.5 as the text height. This is also very important. Then set current. These are the main settings we have to do. Now in auto, uh, now in Excel, yeah, we have to form formulate the formula. Before that, we have to find the data uh, data of these values. So data is best uh, because of the reduce our drawing to our printable area. So I am going to here. We will type the formula as equal, then minimum, then open it, then select those things and close and enter. Right, this is my minimum value. Right here, the minimum minimum value of this. Uh, Elevation. Here I have to find the maximum value. Maximum. So the same as uh, I can copy it. Copy. Here the max. Right. Then I have to select this one. Go here. Right. That is our area is okay. Then it maximum point this here so we can find how much uh, this uh, deviation here enter uh, 2 meters deviation is here. so we can fix uh, as this data mass 25 also the rounded value data and taking guess 0 0.25.00 this is my data right this is my data so I am fixing it okay because this is helping us in AutoCAD to fix the data now I am going to get the formula here we have I am going to change this uh, uh, this change and elevations as coordinate I am taking as change as as x value and elevations as y value so type equal x value and uh, inverter commas, comma, inverter commas, and y value. Right, I got this. Then copy it. Then select those things uh, which uh, we want to place the coordinate. So select those things and press enter. So automatically inverted uh, as coordinates. This point one, point two, likewise, uh, we can get seventy seven point. Right, uh, our Excel work is done. Now I am going to copy those uh, coordinates. Copy. Control C is better. Then click on AutoCAD. I don't know in AutoCAD window. I am going to paste this. Click on uh, polyline. Then polyline specific start point. First of all, you have to open this snap point. So the snap. Then 
right click here then paste it yeah this card so this is my profile so select this and go to i already created ls profile layer so i go it then uh, i am going to place the vertical line so denote the x values and y values so type uh, click here the construction line then click it uh, vertical then paste it here right this also done now i'm going to select those things and click here and vertical line this is my vertical line now i don't want uh, above this uh, profile so select this and enter i'm going to trim it right the construction line again for sonder uh, 0 comma 0 and then i am going to trim it right trim it if you uh, here the scale is high so if you want the scale you can reduce that like this right click and go to properties and change value is uh, 0.2 close it okay, here that's nice and done now i am going to uh, already i have done my textile uh, annotation style this is 0.5 uh, i already created uh, this gauge box and also the data value okay, the data value is not 25 here 000, 000, uh, 0, 0, 0. yeah uh, i am going to put these values this derivation and change it here so that you see this here so go to load application and here i already uh, created this application x y uh, in uh, description i will put uh, so please go to here yeah, and download it uh, it's freely available so load it and close right i already put uh, that application into my autocad now i am going to put this uh, value here right type x y enter to choose an object this is my object please turn off this uh, all snaps and first point is going to be here second point will be here the 28.5 0 the 10 the 20 30 40 50 likewise i already got those uh value like this if you want or you don't want this line so place it here and select in it and you can it In uh, one minute, in a minute, uh, within a minute, we form completed this one. I can edit it uh, 0 0. <laughs> you can check it here everywhere at the place there. Uh, chain it and also the elevation. Right? Uh, this is uh, the main way, the easy way to place those. It is in or uh, it is no less likewise it's the best way and uh, now this uh, problem is here uh, data is zero zero but i already i took that uh, data is 25.00 so i didn't convert it uh, further so i am going to convert it uh, uh, 25 this is my data type 25 the 25 meter so if it have 25 meters here 28 is there so we have to reduce the 25 feet so i am going to select this one i'm going to move right move this one and click here this point to go to upside and type 25 25 and in right here this is my data and here this one is done. so select this one and select print to all these things 
Saya kirim tu. These values are very small, we couldn't find the line, so select them all, right click the properties, then to change to 0.5, 0.5, or 0.1, 0.0, this bit, see here, this line, and this value, and this is the elevation and the change. I request you have you can create those uh, more than three uh, or four kilometers or say even one one minute you can put it like this. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe my channel uh, and stay with my channel. Thank you.